Aloha! Today I have an order from um, Yes Style. Now, I ordered this on February 12th, I think it was. It did not arrive until March 20th. And I had express shipping. They didn't even send it out until March, um, looking at the calendar, they sent it out on March 18th. So the express shipping part, you know, fine. You know, you they ship it on Monday and I got it on Thursday. But the fact that it took them four week over a month to pull all the items and get it sent out, that's extraordinary. So this is the first time I've ever ordered from them and I'm not sure. I ordered quite a few items and every day I checked it well not every day but after about three weeks I started checking like every other day then it got to the point where it was every day <laughs> and I check my order and it which and it shows you um, if you go into the app it shows you or their website it shows you um, in stock and ready to be shipped or out of stock awaiting arrival and it's like when I first ordered everything was in stock they could have put it together that night and shipped it out but as time went on something would go out of stock and then it would come back into stock but something else would be out of stock and then that would go would come back in stock and then something else would be out of stock so I don't know if they were waiting for everything to be in and available. It, it really doesn't make sense because if I've ordered it, it should just be set aside for me. So I don't know. Um, but we're going to see if it was worth it. If I can even get the thing open. I'm trying not to cut anything in the package. Oh my, okay. So it looks like what they do is they box it up into a plastic container. Um, and I guess everything is in here. I mean, I ordered a lot of individual items, but they're all small. Um, I ordered some toiletries. I remember I ordered a pair of earrings. Um, I don't remember everything offhand though. Good lord. A lot of tape. Okay. Oh, more tape. Um, it's in the container. It's all bubble wrapped. And then the bubble wrap is taped. I wonder if I can... Okay, here we go. So they ship securely, it looks like. Oh, okay, here we go. Um, here's my list of everything. 11 items, one of which was a f the free gift with purchase. Um, that can't be it, but that looks like it. Oh, okay, the free gift is Tony Moly sheet masks, um, snail mask sheet. And it said a 100, yeah, it says Pureness 100 mask sheet. I thought it was like 100 masks. No, that's just the name of it, Pureness 100. You get one mask. Um, I thought that was kind of nice for a free gift, but okay. So I will try this one out. Um, see if you can. See that? I don't know how my camera is going to focus on these. Um, I don't know that I like the snail mask, but I'll check it out. Um, I just don't know cruelty wise. How do they get the snail slime? I, I've never looked into that and so I don't know. Okay, this is one of the reasons I was ordering from them, my Jeju Volcanic. This is the pore scrub foam, which I use to cleanse my face in the morning. 
feels fantabulous. Um, there's another Jeju in here. This is the Pore Lotion. Um, and I've been out of this for several months, which is why I wanted to order it. Uh, this stuff feels so good. And I did get a, um, a free sample when I ordered something from Sephora, I think, of NARS lotion. And honestly, you know, for as much as the NARS costs, I like this better. Um, so I am really happy to have this again. I got a phone case. Yay! My pineapple. Uh, I don't, you know, it was like on sale and cheap, so I got it. Um, Lash Perm Proof Mascara. That's the box. And right now, I actually, I have a sty or something. I don't know if it's an infection or a sty. I think it's a sty. So I can't wear eye makeup. My eye is all puffy. And last night, during the night, it was itching really bad. I kept waking up and rubbing it. Okay, so this is Etude House. Um, it's Lash Perm. Lash Perm Mascara, and I'd heard good things about this, so I wanted to try it. So after my sty goes away, I'll try that. Oh, these, I've missed these. I've been out of these for a few months, too. These are the COSRX pads, and I actually did go and buy some because this was held up for so long. Um, these are the original pads. And at the end of the day, uh, when I'm just before bed, I take one of these pads and I wipe any leftover dirt and grime off my face, and it feels so good. Um, and, you know, I wash my face when I get home from work, and I get all the makeup off, but then this kind of does a final, like a final rinse before I go to bed. And... Um, they're like moisturizing at the same time that they've removed anything else that's on there. And it just, it's like a nice end of the day little perk. What's this one? Oh, the Lip Sleeping Mask. Um, I have heard good things about this too. The Laneige, is it going to focus? There we go. So, I thought, okay, let's try it. Opened it upside down. Okay, so. Oops. Oh, it smells good. It smells like a sugar cookie. I'm going to try it real fast, even though it's not night. Mmm. Okay, it feels good. I'll have to do a review on this and see, is it going to focus? There we go. Um, I'll do a review on this after I've used it for a while. I normally just use Vaseline on my lips. For some reason, lipstick just like really dries them out. Even the ones that say they're ultra moisturized and blah, blah, blah. Um, the same thing with um, lip balms. And other lip things I've tried, I've tried sugar scrubs, and you know, 20 minutes later I have to put Vaseline on them. Uh, everything just seems to make my lips feel dry, and I don't know. And I don't know if that's just because I've gotten so used to the Vaseline because I've been using it on my lips since I was in high school, junior high, something like that. Okay, a couple more things. Um, let's see, this one is. Oh, this is the gel eyeliner from McQueen. So this is the box. They stick their stickers all over. So I don't know if it's going to focus. I hate it when people hold their hands up like this, but I understand why they do. But it just, it looks terrible in a video. So I'm trying not to do that myself. 
Okay, so this is gel eyeliner again. Can't wear makeup right now. Ooh, can't get it out. Okay, oh, pretty. Let's see if I can. Yeah, I don't think it's going to focus on this. Uh -huh. So, um, it's just a black. Oh, and it twists up. I like that. Um, I usually use the sticks, but I don't like it because they wear down so fast and you have to do the the eyeliner pencil sharpener thing and it seems like you waste so much of the eyeliner when you do that. Okay, this one is oh, seven days perfect tattoo eyebrow. Um, before I had chemo, I had my eyebrows um, tattooed, and it's really hard to find someone here in Hawaii who can do lighter colors because everyone is dark hair, um, and it's kind of fading out right now, and it's only been a year. Oh, this is nice. Yeah, my perfect swatch job. See, and this is just, and it's hard to find an eyeliner that is a lighter brown. They're all, everybody apparently wants dark black eyebrows. I don't. It looks terrible when you have hair as light as mine. So I'm anxious to try that. And the last thing I have, I'll put this aside. Um, oh, it's two things. Oh, that's right. Okay, I got a necklace and a pair of earrings. And so, in fact, I didn't even wear earrings today. Huh. So, I just thought these were cute. And did something just fall off? Oh, it's the back to one of them. Um, they're the French hoops, and they have those little stoppers on them. Oh my, it's wound <laughs> all the way around. Okay, so there's one missing. Maybe it's still in the bag. They're just little pink flowers with pearl centers. If it will focus on that. Can it? Let's see if I can get them to see if I can do this in some professional manner. Um, show. There they are. I just thought they were cute little earrings. And no, it looks like I only got one stopper for them, which is odd, but okay. <laughs> and then the other one is a necklace. Oh dear, it's all twisted up and Hot. What the heck? Oh, that's where it... Oh, actually the chain looks kind of nice. Um, this is a... Let's see if I can get it to go right. This is a cat in a moon. A silver cat in a gold moon. And it's just kind of a dainty little necklace. Um, the, like I said, the chain looks really nice. Uh, I've ordered a lot from Wish, and those are always cheap, cheap, cheap. Um, so, let's see if I can get up. So that's, I like that. And it's not too short. I, I hate the ones that come up here. So, that is my Yes Style order, and I will link them down below. And none of this is sponsored. Um, I did not, you know, I ordered this on my own, and so none of that. <laughs> Make sure I get that out there. Um, I think I forgot to say that in my last couple of videos when I did the shirt reviews, but those were also... Um, 
I ordered those on my own. They were not sponsored. I'll make sure I have that down in the comments section. And that's it. So make sure that if you haven't subscribed, you hit the subscribe button. Ding that bell so that you get a notice of the next video I put out. And as always, hit that like button so that I know people are watching. And if you have any ideas for future reviews or something else you'd like to see, put a comment down below. And I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.